Hey guys, Innate here. And today, I'm going to be reviewing the Canon 55-250 to lens. Let's get to it. Okay, so here in my hands, I have the Canon 55-250 to lens. So, you know, pretty basic zoom lens. Plastic mount, plastic body, um, has a, extends quite a little bit, focus, focus ring and zoom ring on the lens itself. Its full name is Canon Zoom Lens EFS 55 to 250 millimeters, 1, colon, 4 to 5.6, image stabilization, so this, this lens is actually a little bit older of a lens, but I got it because it's a little bit cheaper. I'll have a link down in the description below so you can check it out. It's actually, this one's actually been discontinued by Canon, and they have another one that's more expensive that goes to it. Now the ring around the outside that the lens cap fits on is a 58 millimeter ring there. So that's the size filter you have to get to put on there. Size lens cap you'd have to get to put on there, all that good stuff. Now it has autofocus and image stabilization. That's why I got this lens over the cheaper, oh, what was it, 75 to 300? Because that one doesn't have image stabilization. Now, Canon have come out with a new one of that that does have image stabilization, but it's a lot more expensive. This one I picked up for like $130 or something like that. So, really, a pretty good zoom lens. Yeah, it is an EFS mount, so if you don't have a crop sensor Canon camera, it's, it's not going to work for you. Now with it, I also got the newer, near, 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 N-E-E-W-E-R, ET-60II lens hood. And this, this lens hood is made, I think for this lens, or lenses like this, probably. So you know, it's a nice nice big lens hood, and you just fit it on, slide it into the spot where it goes, and then twist it into place. It stays just like that. And I got, I opted for the lens hood, so I didn't have to put a filter on it to protect the glass. So if I was looking through the camera and bumped into something, it'd bump into the lens hood, and wouldn't actually bump into the lens itself. Because the lens hood is like, what, like 6 or $10 or something like that? I'll link that down below as well. Here's a few test shots of what the Canon can do. Okay, so here is a test of the zoom lens. So as you can see, here's my hand for reference. Pinky's on the table. So he's, you know, 7 inches tall or so. And here's the lens at... 55 millimeters, the farthest zoomed out it can get. So as I zoom in, you can see, oh yeah, and the subject's about four feet away, roughly. So that gives a perspective. So, as I start to zoom in here, you can tell he starts getting actually quite a bit closer. So now we're at about 100. You can see you're actually really pretty close. So zooming in some more, like, oh my gosh, he's huge. Well, that's only at 200 now. But if we keep on going, there's 250. So that's stupid close. At this range, you're never going to zoom in to 250. So, you're like, well, why would I want to zoom in on the nose of my stuffed animal? Well, you don't. But, but, if you're ever going to take headshots of someone standing a little bit farther away and not needing to stand right up in their face is a very very helpful thing to be able to do okay so now for the other more real life example so that if we have a, our backyard here this is at 55 so you know that's a pretty good wide angle 
we have the table down below, we have the yard, but then if you want to zoom in on something way out there, like the climber set, you're way zoomed in. So like at this level, you could take a shot of the kids playing from the comfort of your own home. Really, really helpful zoom lens to have if you're going to be a distance away, if you're trying to shoot sports, if you're going to do portraits from a little distance away. Yeah. So yeah, links down below. Buy it if you wanted to get a zoom lens for your crop sensor camera. Um, it's a really good basic zoom lens. So if that's what you're looking for, go for it. Nice little starter, that's why I got it, because it's a nice little starter zoom lens. It's not like $2,000 or anything, but you know, nice and simple. But yeah. See you guys in the next video.